So just last night, I had a client who messaged me on my Instagram DMs. He slid in my Instagram DMs and he was asking me, coach, how do I get the ability to be able to talk to any girl at any time and any place? There was obviously a situation. He tried talking to this one girl at the mall. She was smiling back at him. He got shy. He went the other way. He was with his friends and all that stuff. It was a whole situation. But anyways, that is a perfect question. That's exactly what I'm going to talk about in this video. So stay tuned. Watch the video until the very end to gain the most possible out of the video. What's going on, guys? My name is Assam from DopeLifeCoaching.com. And today I'm going to be talking about how to talk to any girl at any time and any place. So if it's your first time on this channel, man, do yourself a favor and hit that subscribe button and also hit the bell icon so you don't miss a single thing in the future. All right, so back to the subject. The ability to be able to talk to any girl at any time and any place is a pretty easy ability to develop, contrary to what you might think. You might think it has to be a God-given trait. You might think you have to have been raised in a household where it's majority girls, like you have a lot of sisters, when really it's actually none of that stuff. Now, although there are guys who may potentially be, you know, God-given in terms of their abilities with women, but beyond that, you certainly could develop this type of ability. And here's exactly what I want to tell you. This type of ability, it's going to come at a price. It's not just going to come out of thin air by me telling you this magic secret formula that's just going to work in like five seconds and get that stunning hot woman in the mall to talk to you and come sleep with you. No, that's just ridiculous. It's a loser's mindset. But instead, in a very short amount of time, I guarantee you, I promise you, if you follow my steps, you will dramatically improve these skills, like dramatically, night and day difference. So here it is. Before I start... So here it is. Now, before telling you what it is, I actually used this myself when I was 21 years old, years ago, with one of my friends. And I've told a lot of my clients about it and it actually worked for them. And I'm certain it can and will work for you too. So here's the steps. What I want you to do over the course of the next month is to give yourself the homework of going to any public spot there's no spot in particular, could be the mall, could be the outlet center, could be a public park with a lot of women, could be any of those things. Just not the bar, because when you go to the bar and clubs, a lot of women have their guard up naturally because a lot of guys approach them that way and they just kind of have their guard up and even though they're dressed sexy, they don't necessarily want you to approach them. As counterintuitive as that might sound, it's true. But here's what I want you to do. Over the next month, you approach 50 different women. The more attractive, the better. And talk about literally anything. I'm not going to give you a script. I'm not going to give you a specific tactic. You go talk to her about anything. You could approach her and be like, hey, I thought you were attractive. How's your day going? Literally anything like that. Or just, hey, and keep in mind, you certainly are going to mess up at first. And that's okay, dude. I was there myself. I was 21 years old when I was first doing this at the mall, but I succeeded in the end because I've done it so many times. And that's what I want for you. So what you're going to do is you're going to talk to these girls and then you'll notice that the first couple times your heart's going to basically sink. You're going to feel like your heart's racing and you're so scared because you're talking to a stranger, an attractive girl, and you're not used to it. But let me tell you something. After the fifth, the sixth, the tenth, the fifteenth girl, that fear is basically going to go away. And then when you get to around woman number 40 or 50, you're going to develop that inner ability to talk about whatever you want with whoever you want at whatever time you want, no matter how attractive the woman is. At first, it's going to start off by you saying, hey, I thought you were attractive. You might fidget a bit. You might be a bit nervous. Then you might be like, all right, I'm leaving. But then after getting your reps in, you're naturally going to be able to maintain that conversation, not just start it, but maintain it without necessarily me having to tell you how to do it. You're naturally going to know how to build rapport. And by the way, I'll link the video right here just in case you want to watch it, even though you'll naturally learn this. But anyways, it's a plus. So when you start talking to these women, by the time you get to woman number 50, 
What I want you to do is to think long-term, not short-term. What does that mean? It means that I don't want you to be concerned with getting her number or a particular result, following her on social media, taking her out. No, I just want to instill within you the ability to be able to talk to any woman at any time, at any place. Could be at the line at Starbucks, could be at the line at the bookstore, the line at the grocery store, at the gas station, could be in college if you're in college, and it could be that you're literally walking into the library and you see an empty table with literally one woman there and you can just go talk to her right then and there. I've done that myself and it works wonders. So what I wanna tell you is, by the time you get to the 40th or the 50th woman, everything's gonna be so natural for you, you're not even gonna to have to think about what you say. As a matter of fact, you'll start to notice that a lot of these women are actually nervous to talk to you because you're speaking with so much confidence. You're looking them in the eye. You're so present. You're not fidgety. You're not scared. You're not shaking. You're not doing any of that. And also what you'll notice is out of those 50 women, there will be a couple who are most likely going to go out with you. This isn't necessarily a guarantee. If your style sucks and you smell bad, you don't look decent, you might just get zero. But I want you to, you should know this already, I want you to look decent and presentable. Do your hair right, your beard right, brush your teeth, get some Listerine packs or gum if your breath doesn't exactly smell too good, and just approach these women. And I'm telling you, man, in just a short amount of time, I'm giving you a month to approach 50 different attractive women who are strangers, not even mutual friends or like friends of friends, none of that. Total strangers, you go to the mall, the outlets, you could go to the park, anywhere that's public. And again, not a spot where they will have their guards up, such as the club, because contrary to popular belief, a lot of women get approached by guys at the club, even though they're showing off their bodies, their guard is fully up and every other guy is doing that. Remember, if every other guy is doing it, you don't want to do it because she's going to be expecting every single guy to do that and it's probably not going to turn her on. However, if she's going about her business and she's at the mall, she's literally bored out of her mind and you come approach her, who knows? She might just be into you. And I also want to tell you another thing, dude. Most women are not going to like you. Most women are not going to be into you. So basically, out of those 50 women that you approach and you talk to, hopefully, and you build rapport with, you might only have one or two women who are interested in you, maybe three, maybe five, it's an average, maybe, maybe even zero. But the whole idea is we're not concerned with the result. We're concerned with developing the ability within us to be able to talk to any woman at any time and any place. I guarantee you, man, in a short amount of time, if you just follow these instructions and you're man enough and you have the balls and you muster up the courage to go ahead and do it, you will succeed in a short amount of time. Let me even tell you about my experience. I did this when I was 21 years old. At the time I was with one of my friends and I had tried before telling him about this, before I tried doing it by myself without telling him about it, I never really did it. Every time I wanted to go talk to a girl, I kind of chickened out. However, it got to the point where I told him this idea and he was in, he was down to do it. So then I kind of had someone watch me. So I was kind of forced, I kind of forced myself to go talk to women at the mall. So the first couple of women, they were kind of awkward to talk to. I appeared confident, but I swear to God, I was not confident. I was so nervous. I went ahead and talked to her and said she had a nice smile or whatever. And then I think I asked for her number after just literally like two, three sentences, which you obviously shouldn't do, but I didn't know any better. And uh, she didn't give me her number, but I was like totally fine about it because, you know, my friend was encouraging. And so I did it to the second, the third, the 10th, around the 15th woman, it was kind of natural to me. And then we went ahead, me and him, and we did it a couple times by around maybe the fifth or sixth time. He was like, dude, you're such a natural at this. I remember specifically, he said this one thing. He was like, you flow, you're just so free like the air. And hearing that, it just gave me an ego stroke. I was like, I was so happy to hear that. But the fact of the matter is, all I did was I put myself out there and I put the reps in and eventually it got to the point where I didn't care who I was talking to or how attractive she was. I was just confident because I did it so many times. By a certain number amount of times, it's already part of who you are. And now, whenever I am out in Starbucks, in the line in the grocery store, at the gym, wherever, I still have that same ability that I gained when I was 21 years old because of doing this. 
And also, here's a plus. I did get a couple of girls' numbers, more than a couple actually, and I've been out with a couple of women after doing this. So it's a win-win situation. And there was a learning experience at the time too. And I remember I was 21 years old. And I went out with a 29 year old at the time. She was attractive too. And obviously my, my ego was like through the roof. My head was in the clouds because I implemented this strategy and sure enough, I wasn't perfect, but at least I tried and I built that ability within me. And that ability is still there until this day because I did that. I'm not afraid to talk to anyone, to anyone, not just women, old people on the line, a guy who I think he has nice shoes, a girl who has a nice shirt, even if I'm not attracted to her. I just talk to people everywhere I am. That's just who I am. So I'm telling you, man, as much as you want a specific tactic, a specific formula, a specific method of approach, here is the method. It's real simple. You just go and do it so much times, a ton of times to the point where you become a natural at it. And then you'll naturally develop that ability. The only recommendation I have is to approach the women from the front, not the back, because if you just tap them on the back and then like they look like this right behind them, they might think you're a creep. Not all of them, but many of them will. So just do that, man, and see what happens. I'm excited for you. And I'm sure this is going to work. Even if you don't get the desired result, the built-in ability to be able to talk to any woman at any time in any place that in itself is strength and that in itself is success. So that's pretty much it, guys. If you like the video, make sure you show your support by hitting that thumbs up button. And also, if you want consistent updates on similar videos just like this, do yourselves a favor and hit the subscribe button and also the bell icon so you don't miss a single thing in the future. Comment down in the comment section below for future videos or ideas that you'd like me to cover. And I'd be way more than happy to cover them. Go to my website, www.dopelifecoaching.com. We still have free consultations for first timers, man. So make sure you take advantage of that offer. Now that's about it, man. Go out there, put yourself out there, talk to as many women as you find attractive and do not be afraid of failure because it's okay to fail temporarily. Pick yourself back up and try again, no matter how awkward it seems to you at first or how awkward that girl made you seem. She's irrelevant. What matters is the goal. Keep your mind on the goal and that ability to develop. And trust me, man, great things are going to happen. Mark my words, man. You got this, bro. I'm out here. Peace.